This is a view from uh, an external camera on the Soyuz MS-14 spacecraft, the unpiloted spacecraft. In the lower left-hand corner of this engineering uh, camera view, you see uh, 1.6 kilometers, and then the value underneath, uh, minus four decimal four three meters per second. That is uh, the distance uh, between uh, the Soyuz and the International Space Station and its rate of closure on the station. Fly around and work. The uh, fly around uh, of the International Space Station has begun. Now that we're inside 400 meters, the fly around angle of 62 degrees will uh, position the MS 14's forward docking probe uh, uh, in precise alignment with the aft port of the Zvezda service module, which again uh, was cleared last night, about 24 hours ago, with the relocation of the Soyuz MS 13 spacecraft that had been uh, docked uh, to uh, Zvezda since its arrival uh, with Skvortsov, Parmitano, and Morgan back on July 20th. The International Space Station uh, flying into an orbital sunrise, about to pass directly over the capital of Turkey, Ankara. This view now from the uh, Soyuz MS-14 external engineering camera. About 180 meters separating Soyuz from the aft port of the Zvezda service module, which is visible almost at the center of the crosshairs. As uh, the fly around is uh, about to be completed, Station keeping confirmed. And uh, the Russian flight control team confirms uh, that station keeping has begun. 100 meters now separating Soyuz from the service module. This view from a truss camera on the International Space Station. Good alignment uh, between the Soyuz, the core's automated rendezvous system operating normally so far. A good view of uh, the aft uh, docking port on the Zvezda service module. Zvezda having launched in July of 2000 as the uh, centerpiece of the Russian segment of the International Space Station. 45 meters. 45 meters, copy, Alexander. And this view is uh, from a television camera on the aft port of the Zvezda service module. This uh, was the same camera that was employed when the European Space Agency's automated transfer vehicle, the ATV, was delivering cargo to the International Space Station. The range is about 35 meters, by my estimate. This view uh, looking dead on to the uh, forward docking probe on the Soyuz uh, MS-14 spacecraft as it negotiates the final few meters before contact and capture. Range is about 31 meters. <laughs> Copy. Copy. And once again, uh, this view uh, of the slowly approaching Soyuz vehicle from a television camera on the aft uh, end of the Zvezda service module right next to the docking target itself. 20 meters.
15 meters now separating uh, the Soyuz uh, from this view from the Zvezda aft port camera. Approach uh, confirmed. Uh, the motion is very uh, slow and steady. Everything looks nominal within the approach corridor. The approach continues uh, to be right on the money as we stand by for contact and capture of the International Space Station. Right on the doorstep, the Soyuz about to contact. Contact confirmed and capture confirmed at 10.08 p.m. Central Time, 11.08 p.m. Eastern Time as the International Space Station flew 260 miles over eastern Mongolia. The Soyuz MS-14, on its second attempt, is home at the aft port of the Zvezda service module, completing the first phase of its test flight. And the docking probe uh, on the forward end of the Soyuz is now in the process of retracting.